Uh, hello everybody, this is uh, Mike Martin again and today I'm going to show you how those uh, Venom replacement batteries for the Devolt tools are really like. Uh, what they are, I'm going to open one up. I haven't one, I just received them in the mail. I ordered one in the States on eBay. Uh, I just checked here on the on my tablet actually. So that cost me like $38 plus um, oh, roughly $25 for the shipping. So I hope you can see this here. This is the pack and I got them from the seller. What's his name? Fun Young 2017 was 30, $37. So I have to say something here too. The shipping for this, when I say $25 is because I'm located in Costa Rica. So everything to us is much more expensive than in the United States. Costa Rica is a very expensive country. So if I compare this with, those are aftermarket batteries, but you know, there are different reviews on, uh, on YouTube. So now you're gonna have mine, you know, it's gonna be an honest one. I'm gonna tell you exactly what it is. Uh, locally, an original battery, replacement battery, this one, Cost 70,000 colonies. This is $120. So this is exactly twice as much as they sell on Amazon. For an Amazon, I can buy $119, $120. I can buy two one and have them shipped here for about another $25 to $30. So two batteries cost me in Costa Rica $150. I buy one in Costa Rica, it's roughly $120. So. Uh, to say the least, we are really screwed down here. Anyway, I'm, I decided I give it a try after reading some reviews. Some people say good stuff about those. So why not, you know? All right. Um, the batteries came packed in this thing here. Well, this is not very well packed. Anyway, and then mm, they came in here, cardboard box. You can see this, this is all damped up, but it's not a problem. And we don't need this anymore. And here is a brand new one. This is exactly, this I never opened. This is how they come. This is how they packed up. Let's get it out so you can see this. Okay, nothing else in here. Okay, they got this bubble wrap. Um, and there it is. 18 volts. Venom. I hope you can see this. This is a 18 volts, 4 amp, 72 watts hour. It's a nickel uh, metal hybrid battery. So this is a little bit different to the original DeWalt batteries because they are nickel cadmium. Okay, we're gonna put this aside. There's a little piece of paper in here. Let's see what it says. Uh, battery use and care, safety and all this blah, blah, blah. We all know about it. So, before I put this away, I'm going to measure the voltage on this really quick. Let's see. As they come. This one shows 19.14 volts. Okay, good. So, away it goes. Here, I have one. The second one is in the charger. This is the older uh, DeWalt charger. Uh, because this one can actually charge nickel metal hybrid batteries. The other one, the newer one here, uh, explicitly says only nickel cadmium. So we're not gonna charge it here, we're gonna charge it there. This is an original battery. This one is from the beginning of 2019. And this is the new Venom. So the first thing I noticed that they're different in weight. Now, another thing I noticed they are hard to get out. I mean, look at this thing. I mean, you have to really <coughs> hold this down. It's a bitch. <coughs> okay. So, all right, here's the venom. Both are charged just now. All right, the original shows 20.73 volts out of the charger. And the venom shows 21.09, about the same thing. Okay, 
the weight. This is, I noticed this. Put the original on the scale. I hope you can read the numbers here. Original is 0 0.910 grams. Okay, 0 0.910 grams. The aftermarket, it's lighter, is 0 0.725 grams. So it's like a hundred and roughly 175 grams lighter than the original. Okay, so another thing I did, I got an old drill here. I have like 20 of those tools and we really use them hard. When you stick this in here, it's very easy. No problem. The other one, similar. I have to press a little bit harder here. It's a little bit tougher when it's new, but it goes in and out easy out of the tool as well. So no problem. It's only in the charger. No idea why this is. So let's just, uh, it doesn't really bother me. I don't mind grabbing onto, you know, as long as the batteries are cheap, you know, and, and work. So, let's see what's in there. Okay, never opened one before, so... Get the screws out. The general impression from those batteries is okay. I mean that they, they feel they feel like like the original ones. Material and all except they are lighter. So again okay, now let's have a look. And there it is. Okay, that's how it looks like. Okay, In the inside. Again, this is the Venom 18 volts. And there are the specifications to it. Hope you can read this okay. So, and now let's have a look. Okay. Right here is the first thing I can see. It says CEE NRHF 1.2 volts. All right, have a look. Oh, we're gonna unpack one of those. Why not? Actually, there's nothing in there. That's about that's all there is. Nice. Okay, and there's nothing, at least nothing visible. Let's try another one. Nothing on the battery either. Nope. Okay. Let's have another one. See if we can find something. I'm not gonna take the whole pack apart. I mean, like, take out the cells. I'm just looking for some writing on the cells. But nothing here either. Okay. Not on this one. I saw some videos online where guys opened them up and there's Samsung cells in there and, and nothing here either. Okay. So, so far this looks like it can be anything. All right, here. No. Could it be a coincidence that all the writings in the back? Well, 
Let's try a few more. Probably not. This would be... Nope, nothing here either. This one. No writing on the battery. Nope. One more. No. There's nothing here either. Okay. So, <laughs> there's nothing. You know what? Maybe I can pull this out. I think so. Yeah, it comes out. There it is. This one, we can probably and pack a little more oh, let's have a look okay no there's nothing there's nothing on the batteries Okay, so, fact is, we have absolutely no clue what's in there. If people can say whatever it is, there's a sticker that says Tech Week 2008. <laughs> it's 12 years ago. Let's hope this is not 12 years old. I'm going to put this to work. We're going to try this, of course, like the other. And... Uh, I'm gonna keep you guys posted how this thing is how this thing is performing and uh, well if it's actually worth it shipping as it stands right now this pack cost me about or those two packs actually cost me about 40% I'd say roughly maybe 35 to 40 percent as the originals here in Costa Rica in Costa Rica, like I said, you know, we pay twice as much as everybody else for this kind of stuff. So, um, please subscribe to get the second part of this because we're going to have another look at this. And um, so I can keep you posted. Thank you very much. And uh, yeah, like I said, subscribe and come back for the second part.